So the James Follis Juvenile Handicap Hurdle next in, or Formula One Follis to give him his proper name. And it's a two mile naught to one ten for four year olds. And the top one is Nigel Lawson for Paul Rhodes. Practice for James Shea, Alina Avery for Alex Cherry, Madeira Flutter and Terrible King both for Thomas Rogers. Naked Twister for Craig Beckwith. The Big Yin, Alex Cherry, Zone Zero, Graham Clutterbuck, Thunder Queen, James Shea. And Ryan Costello's got the bottom two, Moving Goer and a Needle Pin. So 11 of them then. And aerial sweep of the track called in and away they go so the lowest rated of the four mile four year old hurdlers and the majority of them ran earlier in the week well, these are the lower graded ones as they get to the first of the ten they're all safely over it and a needle pin in the lead from moving Guerre in second so the two Ryan Costello horses in his two different silks are first and second at this stage with Elina Avery in third for Alex Cherry and comes at zone zero on the inside his second Alex Cherry horse is the big in and then practice Thunder Queen and Terrible King all in the same colours with on the wide outside Nigella Lawson and the back two are Naked Twister and Madeira Flutter so over the second a mistake there by zone zero I see that one shuffled towards the back a little bit but the leading pair are still the same and it's a needle pin who takes them over that one from moving Guer in second a gap off two lengths back to Elina Avery and the big in in third then practice and Thunder Queen with Nigella Lawson on the outside moving Guer and a needle pin taking them along over flight number four they go and that time the one down on its nose was Thunder Queen and that one is now shuffled to the back as they pass the big screen past the winning post and out on one more complete circuit with moving Guer just in the lead on the inside of a needle pin and a gap back to Elina Avery in third another mistake at the back by Thunder Queen not hurdling very well at all that one maybe the National Hunt flat race and flat race is beckon for that one it's going to keep hurdling like that but it's moving Guer in front a needle pin second and a line of every third and the big in four and then practice five as they get over number six and they're quite well strung out to say this is only a two mile up and moving Guer is taking them along the steady pace, two lengths up on stable mate, a needle pin, a liner Avery and the big in, poised in third and fourth, practice and zone zero getting closer, then a gap back to Terrible King and Madeira Flutter, Naked Twisters trying to get going up the inside, and Nigella Lawson not going at all today, and Thunder Queen at the back as they take number seven, and they're all still on their feet, and the big in is the one that's coming through to challenge the Costello pair to start with, so it's moving Guet, still two lengths up but now it's the big yin that's in second as a needle pin starts to give way the one that's really coming through nicely is zone zero if i hadn't made that mistake earlier we would probably be sharing the lead by now but moving guerra still got that lead the other one that's really making good ground is the gray terrible king but they get over the third last then and moving guerra's kicked on again and is three clear of the big yin then a needle pin trying to come back into it then zone zero as they get over the second last and look at this thunder queen and terrible king thunder queen is now going really well but it's moving guerra and a needle pin it's a Costello 1-2 again as they race down towards the final furlong and a half then and moving Guerra is now being challenged by a stable companion and needle pin they've only got one to take and these two are clear it could be a 1-2 for Ryan Costello needle pin looks like he's taken this one by the scruff of the neck practice is running on over the final flight and a needle pin is clear but practice is beginning to reel him in needle pin needs the line here comes practice needle pin's got a hold on needle pin wins it practice second moving Guerra third in zone zero and the big yin and naked twister and all the way back to Madeira Flutter. What a strange old race that one. And a needle pin who looked beaten at one point comes back to take it quite comfortably. Yeah, they slight colour change in the graphic, but nothing to get too alarmed about. And it's a 1 3 for Ryan Costello, who seems to have hit form in the last couple of weeks. So a needle pin for Ryan Costello, the winner. Practice for James Shows having a good day in second. Moving Guerre for Ryan Costello, third. Zone zero for Graham Clutterbuck, fourth. And the big yin for Alex Cherry was fifth.